uh, Frank Silva was the set decorator and we were shooting in Laura Palmer's bedroom and Frank was uh, moving furniture around and somebody said, a woman said, Frank, don't lock yourself in that room because he had just moved a chest of drawers in front of the door. And I wasn't even looking in that direction, but the image of Frank locked in that room popped into my head. And I rushed to Frank and I said, Frank, are you an actor? And he said, why, I happen to, yes, be, happen to be. And I said, you're going to be in this movie. And he said, fantastic. And so I had Frank hide on one pan shot across Laura Palmer's bedroom, freeze down by the bars of the bed and just be looking right at the camera. And we shot that. And I didn't know what I was going to use it for, no idea at all. We kept shooting in Laura Palmer's house, and that night we were shooting one of the last things, the last thing in the house. Mrs. Palmer's uh, tormented on the couch, smoking a cigarette, and scenes are playing back in her head, and suddenly she sees something in her mind, bolts upright, and screams. Sean Doyle, he got that right, and it tilts up and captures the scream perfectly. And I said, fantastic. And Sean says, no, it's not fantastic. I said, Sean, what is the matter? He said, someone was reflected in the mirror. I said, who was reflected in the mirror? And he said, Frank Silva was reflected in the mirror. And that's when I knew that Frank was part of the scene.